Dennis Hopper fell in love with New Mexico in 1969 while filming Easy Rider, which he co-wrote, directed, and starred in. The film is still one of Hollywood's most iconic, even getting him an Oscar nomination. You might also recognize him as the villain in the movie Speed with Sandra Bullock or the one-eyed bad guy in Waterworld starring Kevin Costner. Some of his classic films are Giant, Blue Velvet, and Apocalypse Now. James Dean was a close friend to Hopper, and his tragic death in 1955 took a tremendous toll on the star, causing him to change his behavior and take a seven-year break until John Wayne got him back in the spotlight. Far from the lights of Hollywood, he found tremendous peace in the nature and people of Taos. He was um, just like a regular guy off the street, so it was just something pretty special to have met him. He bought the Mabel Dodge Lujan House, and locals renamed it the Big House. He settled there for more than a decade, converting Taos's El Cortez Theater into a home and studio where he would make art and catch up with friends. He lost his battle to cancer on May 29, 2010, and is buried in Rancho de Taos, where stars like Jack Nicholson paid their respects. We're Listen so amazing the way. Really miss him. A Hollywood legend so drawn by the beauty and spirit of our state, he made it his final resting place. And locals are not about to forget him declaring May 17th Dennis Hopper Day, where bikers and townspeople honor him every year.